Hi there, I am standing in the Pike Lake Landing neighborhood in Prior Lake. Right there, there's the lake. Um, Prior Lake is known for its large lake of Upper and Lower Prior Lake, but there's also 13 other lakes within this city. And I'm standing here in Pike Lake. I'm in a brand new neighborhood. It's about a 44 acre neighborhood surrounded by parks, wetlands, walking trails, and of course this nice body of water. I wanted to get you inside a couple of the model homes so you can see what your dollar will get you for new construction in Prior Lake, Minnesota. Let's go check it out. All right, so I wanted to start off in this villa home by Ron Clark. This side of the neighborhood is going to be finished off in all villas by Ron Clark, a local builder here in the Twin Cities since the mid-70s. Ron Clark does such a great job of always using high-end materials, high-end finishes to really cater to that executive that's looking to find a new home. So let's walk around this property. This is 4104 Osprey Court. This is a three bedroom, three bath. It's about 3,200 finished square feet, meaning main level and the lower level. And it's on the market for 1,079,000. So let's go ahead and take a look. Okay, so the Ironwood Villa is a one level home, finished basement, and it has the sunroom. So as you enter the property, you'll see there's a front living room that can be staged for all sorts of things and then it walks out here to the dining room. As you enter the house to the left is gonna be the garage and um, into the laundry and it also wraps around to the back of the property. So this has just a really awesome floor plan. Um, these are white oak floors that are stained. They're just beautiful. Floor to ceiling stacked fireplace got cabinets on both sides huge windows wish we had some Sun today but we still have great light in here because there's so many recessed lights and the bright white kitchen and white trim and casement really bring out and make this property shine huge island which is quartz finished and here's a sunroom so this property has, um, it's outside of the foundation of the home. So this is an extra bonus um, to this floor plan. Shiplap wall, coffered ceiling. Let's step outside and take a look at this maintenance free deck. There'll be more homes built off here in the cul-de-sac. Just quiet. All right, so off of the kitchen is going to be the owner's suite. Again, another copper ceiling, ceiling fan huge room. This floor plan is fantastic because it walks through from the owner's suite through the closet and into the laundry room. And upgraded storage always. Like I said, Ron Clark always uses high-end quality products. And this is one of those things that buyers love. They want good. They want upgraded shelving for their um, closet systems. How great. This all connects off of the owner's suite, making things very convenient. I'm gonna show you again how this connects. look at that kitchen. Okay. 
Let's head down to the lower level here. A turned staircase. And we have a finished lower level that is a walkout. So patio door plus lookout windows. So this home <clears throat> is finished with a bar setup with a low countertop. We call that counter height. And then plenty of room for a setup for a party table, game table, and media space as well. So the builder put in floating shelves and then a, a media cabinet below. Nice spot to hang a huge projector TV or whatever fits your, fits your viewing needs. So there'll be two more bedrooms down here and huge storage. Large lower level bedroom with a huge 10 foot closet. And then a 3 4 bath down here. Floor to ceiling, um, or I should say ceiling to tub tile. Really some great finishes, great choices by the design center of this builder. And then here's our third bedroom. It has kind of a little extra bump out as well. The white two panel doors in the lower level, the white trim, white casement, really makes the lower level shine. Including, of course, we've got a lot of daylight because of the windows and the patio door. So bonus, there's a huge storage room here too. Where all the fun furnace and utility items are. But a lot of storage downstairs. All right, so I'm in the second model home for Ron Clark. This is gonna be at 13727 Park Haven here in Prior Lake. Gorgeous kitchen, obviously the focal point here of the main level, 10 foot ceilings and the white cabinets, floor to ceiling, really make it seem like it's even a bigger space than it is. Upgraded appliances. Back here is gonna be our pantry area. And one of my favorite features that builders are doing now are smaller offices. And this one is tucked back behind the kitchen. Um, which is great. It's in the busy part in the heart of the home, um, kind of that spot where you need to have a drop zone and um, a smaller office. This floor plan is, has the vaulted living room, dramatic ceiling, huge chandelier, and a floor to ceiling fireplace. Large maintenance free deck. And the lake is right back there. Into our owner's suite. So, owner's suite is off the living room, but because there's that fireplace stack, I believe it's just a great buffer for noise. Some people get concerned that um, being this close to the living room would be like an audibility factor, not at all with how this built home is built. And again, with that fireplace stack, um, it's very private and quiet back here. Dual closets with upgraded shelving. And into the ensuite with split vanities. beautiful tile here. Okay. 
So the laundry room is going to be here off of the two, two and a half style garage. They had a little fun back here with tile and of course putting in a hook system. And this garage is finished. Okay, this is what a finished garage looks like. Taped, sheet, mud ro rocked, and it's also painted. This home um, does not have um, a heated garage, but those are things that can be added after a sale. Some people do like that here in Minnesota. Electrical panel is out in the garage, so that's a helpful if someone wanted to add a UV um, station for their vehicle. So huge amusement room here in the basement. I love this walk-up bar. Gives a lot more space to a basement or a lower, lower level when you don't have a seating area in front of your bar. A beverage fridge, microwave, all the things you need for your lower level. Triple patio door, recessed lights bring in so much extra light here. And huge media um, cabinets down here. Plenty of room for storage. All right, two more additional bedrooms downstairs. And then we're gonna have tile from, tile from ceiling down to the tub. Nice stacked subway tile. And the final bedroom. And then there's a bonus space in this house um, off of the amusement room it is all finished. Great space for exercise, a secondary office, storage even possibly as well, along with another storage unit back here. So villa homes are incredibly appealing for those folks that want to own a single family detached home but also have association dues to cover um, things like garbage pickup, lawn services, and snow removal. So here at this neighborhood at Pike Lake, the association dues for the villa properties are $250 a month to cover those services. It really gives a great option for homeowners to really lock and leave during certain times of the year where they might want to escape to a warmer climate. So this home here that I'm sitting at on Park Haven is on the market for $1,144,000. Um, if you're interested in learning more about this development or Prior Lake, please feel free to message me. I appreciate your time and hope you enjoyed the tours. Thanks.